Hey what's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video on my channel today. Today we are going with episode number 4 of our Juventus career mode. Uh, we've made a little bit of progress in the league. We've only taken up a couple of points out of the games we've had have played. Uh, as you can see here we are on deadline day so I'm going to go try and make one transfer and uh, that is from uh, a comment from my uh, previous video because I needed a backup cam. Uh, I am going to go pay the release clause um, because I feel like I, it's deadline day. I don't want to uh, sit there and negotiate just in case we don't get a, a, like a good fee. He wants a rotational uh, squad role, which is very good for us because that's what we need him for. Uh, how long do you want this contract? Five years? I don't think he'll want that. Okay, that that's fine. He does want it. Uh, doesn't want to add a release clause, which is good because I don't want that. Uh, salary wise he's already on 47 grand so we're going to give him 50 with a 400k bonus 450k bonus hopefully he does accept this oh he wants a bit more that's fine we still have plenty of money okay so that is uh, the signing that I wanted to make in today's episode because as you can see here we don't actually have a cam backup I mean you could play Marquisio there but I don't think you uh would be able to get away with it so what we're going to do is bring him in for Kadira or Marquisio or one of the defenders I'll bring it for the Siglio I'll move the Siglio up there so yeah he's going to be our backup centre attacking mid instead of using like Marquisio or uh, Kadira because they're not really cams uh, so that's the squad now we've pretty much got uh, Oh, I just discarded the changes. We basically got a, a a good squad, I'd say. I know we don't have much depth in the squad, but I think we do have a decent little uh, uh, squad overall. So if you could uh, leave a like on the video, comment your thoughts down below, and subscribe to the channel if you are new, uh, that would be greatly appreciated. Uh, the the videos have been getting decent support. So we've got deadline day, then we've got a league game against Shivo first Champions League game against uh, Basel and then we got one against Hoffenheim but for today's episode I think I'm going to play this game the Champions League game and probably this game I'm not sure if I'll fit that game in but I will at least play two games so uh, we're going to get through deadline day and we'll see what uh, happens I'm going to do it live I'm not going to cut everything out just in case we do get some uh, offers I don't think we will we might get some for like players like Kadir I've had a few offers for I haven't actually shown uh, me getting bids for players because uh, near enough all of them I've declined apart from the, in the first episode where I showed them but um, I don't think we're going to get any deals done uh, in this window especially not for us uh, buying any more players we don't need to and we've spent quite a bit of money, so I don't think we need to really like spend. So Alexandro has been uh, given a bid of fifty-four million pounds. I'm going to reject that because he is our best left back, who we're not looking to sell. So that looks like it's going to be the end of the transfer window. Yeah, no more uh, bids coming in for any of our players. So what I'm going to do now is I'll I'm going to sim to the next game, and then I'll show you the highlights. So I will be right back. Right guys, as you can see here, we are just about to get into the game, but um, I made uh, quite a lot of changes to the team because uh, we've got that Champions League game coming up and I don't want to play my main team. So Buffon stays in goal. We've got De Siglio, Howardes, Rigani and Asamo as our defence. Kadira and Marquisio, uh, the new signing at Cam, Son on the right still, and Costa still on the left, and then Dolberg up front. So we're going to jump into this game now and we'll see how we get on. Right guys, here we are. Let's go. Let's see how we get on. But we do have the ball still, so it's not that bad. I see Dolberg inside. Can Dolberg do something? He shoots and he puts it wide. First real uh, effort on goal for us in this game. Hopefully we can uh, produce some more chances. Costa's making that run. He still has the ball somehow, Costa. I'm really enjoying using Douglas Costa. He's going to go all the way. Keeper saves it. There's no one there for the rebound. But Douglas Costa really making the impact for the for the team today. And there it is, guys. Half time. 0-0 uh, at the moment. We're not really uh, doing much. 
in terms of efforts on goal really we haven't had that many chances but um, we're into the second half now let's see if we can uh, push on to get this win but Son now picks up the ball cuts inside nice little turn from Son he's very good at that I'm going to keep going with Son here can he shoot oh Son that's a brilliant goal lovely solo goal from Kim Ming Son there really really nice run from Son uh, the defenders are nowhere near him which I'm surprised uh, normally they'd press much higher than what they have and Son's able to blast that into the top right hand corner and we do take a 1-0 lead after that goal from Hume and Son that's full time guys we do take down the victory uh, a 1-0 home victory as well uh, a solid game from us we probably should have scored more goals look at those chances we created they didn't really have many chances but now I'm going to move on into the second game of the episode which is a Champions League game against Basel Guys, first game of the Champions League group stages. Let's get this underway. Let's see how we go. If you do hear any background noise in the background, it is uh, un out of my control. It is people working outside with like diggers and stuff. So hopefully it doesn't affect uh, you too much when you hear the game uh, volume in my voice. So uh, other than that, let's get into this game. Nice play there from Basel. They could be scoring here. And they have scored early in the fourth minute. Really nice cross from El Yunusi there. And uh, I think it was their striker or right winger who scored, Kalia, who makes it 1 0. And uh, unfortunately, we are 1 0 down within the first five minutes. Really, really well played from the keeper there. Higuain front post. Can he score? He does. As soon as I knew that, as soon as that hit Higuain's head, I knew that was going in. Really, really strong header from Higuain at the front post. We've now pulled one back, and it is now 1 1 the target. But it's gone to Benasha. He plays it inside to Matuidi. He turns. Higuain picks up the ball. Can he send in Costa? He can. In behind. Costa's going to burst in with his pace. He's going to send it across to Dybala. Or no, Bernadache. And just like that, guys, we're 2-1 up. Really, really nice play from uh, out from the back from the free kick we had. Uh, Costa across to Bernadache. He slots it into a practically open net. And we're now 2-1 up. And that is half time, guys. Uh, we went down really early in the first uh, five minutes there. But... Um, we brought it back to 2-1 at the uh, half-time stage. So let's move on into the second half and see how we do get on. Another good cross in. Higuain, another good header from Higuain. That's 3-1 to Juventus now. Uh, Higuain has really dominated the the corners and uh, free kicks that we've had this game with headers. And uh, he's it's paid off for him again. We're now 3-1 up. Two headers from Higuain. We're looking like we're going to get a win here. Nice play from uh, Juventus here. Can we uh, pick out Dybala or even Bernadache? We can pick out Bernadache. Can he do something with it? I'm going to cut it back to Higuain for the hat trick. Higuain with the hat trick. I think this is it. This is it, guys. We're going to start raining with goals here. Uh, because just like that, we scored two goals within like the space of five minutes in game. Uh, as you can see there, Higuain, 64th minute, 69th minute. Four one up. We're looking like a. It's going to be a really good victory here for us in the first game of the Champions League group stages. I'm going to bring on a couple of more substitutions, rest Dybala and Higuain. The game is pretty much won, so I don't want to be uh, playing overplaying my players uh, too much. So we brought on Dolberg up front, and we brought on our new Cam uh, Lalic. I don't know how you pronounce that. Dolberg on the ball now. He spins the defender really well. Can he uh, press on here? I don't know if he's going to be quick enough. He looks like he is. There's not really many options. I'm going to have to shoot here. With Dolberg, and that is a really nice finish from the youngster. Really, really good finish from the youngster there. Uh, making the score 5-1 now for Juventus. That is the game set and match. Uh, with goals coming from Bernadache, a hat-trick from Higuain, and the youngster Dolberg getting a goal at the end there. What a win for us in the uh, Champions League. First game of the group stages. And that, guys, is going to be the end of the episode. Look at that pure dominance. 20, 20 shots, 15 on target, 4 uh, shots, 1 on target for the opposition. Uh, if you did enjoy the video, please leave a like, comment and subscribe if you are new. If you made it this far, I really appreciate it. And uh, once again, really good episode. Finally got uh, two wins on the boards, one in the league, one in the Champions League. Uh, and yeah, that's it from me. See you guys in the next episode.